Hello, I'm Will Williamson of the JDR Group and Monday to Friday I'm out around the country meeting with business owners, talking all things to do with business growth, marketing and sales. Today I'm in a beautiful industrial estate in Oxfordshire, uh, get to all the glamorous parts of the UK me. Now I want to have a quick chat about return on investment from marketing. Now, um, uh, as a business owner, you'll have been advised by accountants, you may have been to see marketing consultants, business coaches, business consultants, and the thing that gets drummed into you is that um, marketing should be an investment, not an expense. You should get a return on investment. For every pound you spend on marketing, you should get two pounds back. And, and that is absolutely true and something I, I wholeheartedly agree with. However, um, in most cases, what it leads to is chasing rainbows. Most business owners are expecting that they will get an instant return and that um, as soon as you spend a pound, you should be getting two pounds back, when in reality, that almost never happens. I, I remember once upon a time, I met a, an engineering um, business owner and he was complaining about how no marketing had ever worked for him. And he told me about this once that he spent 500 pounds on an advert in a trade magazine and what a waste of money it was. Um, and I said, why was it a waste of money? And he said, well, I only ever got one customer. And I said, okay, so you spent your 500 pounds and you got one customer. And um, I said, is that customer still with you? And he said, yes. And how long have they been with you? They're about 10 years now. How much do they spend with you every year now? About 10, 20,000 pounds. Right, so your advert may not have paid for itself day one, but over the length of time with that customer, um, you've got an unbelievable return on investment. Most business owners, when they're thinking about return on investment, don't factor in the lifetime value of acquiring customers. Every single customer you get means you've got revenue, hopefully going forward for a long time into the future, and referrals and word of mouth, and you're taking business away from your competition, which strengthens you. So that's the return on investment that you get with marketing. It's not always a case of spend money now, get money back straight away. Sometimes you have to invest in the long term, and that's what great companies do. Most great companies probably lose money on their marketing. Um, in year one, but over time and consistent uh, marketing activities, they build fantastic market shares, which create enormous return on investment in the long run. So that's the way to look at it over a long period of time. Hope that's useful. Uh, thank you for watching. See you soon.